hope you guys doing well and uh, today I'm going to show you that uh, how the grunt babil will work which is a task uh, compiler uh, which is a JS compiler for ES6 so I'm gonna uh, disable my a concatenation and uh, uglify script so it will not conflict with that so I'm gonna comment this one uh, uglify and concatenation comment and now I'm gonna install uh, grunt babil so <coughs> we need to add a grunt which is uh, actually the npm install grunt babil at babil slash core at babil slash preset and so in this uh, video we will learn about uh, something uh, like js compilation with the mm, babil grunt babil so and uh, you can also learn about how you can use this into your project to make your development more um, speed and um, more re reliable for the um, most of the uh, servers and uh, users so once it will be installed uh, I will come up with the actually uh, we need to add some code here here which is uh, grunt actually the bubble semicolon and this is options here and then source should be map and true and uh, I think we got an error because we missed this colon and uh, then we need to add a presets which is uh, babil add babil slash preset and and then add a colon here and then destination which is uh, files and then now we need to define a path of our input and output JS so here we have our folder structure there uh, is the source and uh, destination actually the our destination is dev JS and then uh, production or JS maybe so we need to add the dust here and then uh, dev slash js slash production dot js and then we need to also add the source from where we get the js and uh, here we need to create a folder which is uh, js and then a uh, file which is uh, main.js so <coughs> there is uh, we have created a file and uh, now I'm gonna add the source slash js slash main.js so you can also add the colon here and indent our code so here we have uh, configured our uh, babil.js and uh, now we gonna mm, add 
to the, our task so I'm gonna add a grunt task which is uh, actually the load npm tasks and then add uh, braces and then we need to add babel here so add a semicolon and you can also add this to our default scripts and uh, you are good to go once it will be installed I will continue my video again and show you that how we can write here code and get the results from in our production.js so uh, I will continue my video within a few minutes so where we uh, there we go we have installed uh, uh, grant Babel successfully and then uh, now I'm gonna add some code here which is uh, I'm gonna just so now uh, we need to run the grunt bubble so we are getting an error because our load task is not defined there we have made a mistake we need to add the grunt bubble and then run script again so we have done it uh, successfully so now it's compiled and uh, I'm gonna add some kind of uh, script here where we can uh, compile so I'm going to write the code here which is uh, one two three and then add a map and then uh, n and uh, we need to add a greater than n plus one and uh, add the bracket here with the semicolon and then uh, here we have added another bracket we need to save this and then run a grunt bubble to generate our code so yeah here we go we have generated this code here with the function with the return n plus one so this and that is how the bubble will work and uh, you can also compile your uh, es uh, uh, ecmh script 2015 plus um, mm, into a backward compatibility version of uh, javascript is a current and older browser or environments here are some main things bubble can do for you transform syntax polyfill features that are missing in your target environment through babel polyfix and uh, source code transmission and much more so uh, that's all for now guys this video is for one of our subscriber that uh, have requested us to create this babel uh, tutorial so uh, that is how the babel will work in your grant project that's all for now you guys and uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, click the bell icon for the latest updates from uh, our channel if you have any question if, if you want to um, learn any kind of uh, uh, courses regarding uh, IT solutions uh, or IT field or maybe multi feed media field also that we have covered in this channel so you can also request us um, by uh, simply uh, commenting us of our, any of our video that's all for now guys i hope you guys enjoy my tutorial and uh, uh, see you guys in my next video